said about how he has to dial some of himself down and some of himself up to avoid any further incidents in this situation? No, I think he's going to play with that same aggression, that same passion, leave it all on the floor, but be smart. Um, I think he can do that without having to take a piece of himself away from from what he does on the floor and who he is uh, as a basketball player and a competitor and and whatnot. So um, he won't get baited into any kind of altercations. He won't. I'm pretty sure he'll be talkative, but hopefully in a very constructive kind of way. So um, that'll be good. Tim on the left. I guess you had the film session from the last game this morning. What what do you do when you see your – he had some open threes in the last game. What do you think when you see yourself get that shot and miss that shot a few times in a pretty key spots last game? I don't really worry about the shots that I miss. Um, those are those are ones you live with. You live with the result. You don't really want to go back and analyze, you know, oh, I got open, what happened, why did I miss it, or my, was my, my feet, you know, not square to the basket or did I not hold my follow through or whatever. I don't really worry about that because those shots will come. And if I can keep the confidence, I'll hopefully knock them down the next game. The stuff that kind of bothered me the most is there's on the offensive end of certain possessions where we had the right reads and the right looks, but passes got deflected because they were a little, you know, a little lazy or we didn't have the Christmas to what we were doing. Um, that's a, that was a situation where you feel like you had missed opportunities. Open shots, you know, make or miss doesn't doesn't really bother me that much. But the other stuff that takes us out of the rhythm of our offense, um, that I control most of it, is is the frustrating part. So that was the most glaring thing that we saw on the film, and um, you know, I have to sure that up. And defensively, what would you say the things? What specifically did you not love about that game when you look back on the film? Breakdowns, uh, communicating on on switches and in transition, finding you know our matchups, and certain details of the fundamentals of just body position on on, on defending guys one on one in space. We gave too many angles to the basket where we put our our help defense in, in a bad spot with straight line drives to the basket and 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 whatnot. I mean. It, it might be overblown a little bit because they made so many tough shots. But if you have guys that are hot and you give them uh, those, you know, three to five possessions where you have breakdowns as well, it, it just makes things worse. So, got to uh, got to fix those. Thank you, Steph.